Hey there, welcome back. Last episode I saved Nanako, and now I don't know what to do. <laughs> now that I've saved Nanako, I have no idea what to do with the rest of my time. Um, uh, movie with Naoto. I can't spend time with Naoto. I can't. No. And I also can't complete the fox's request because I need a fishing pole and I need to make it. <laughs> Using a really complicated string of events. Uh, oh, you know what? I think I have a little bit of money. I can buy some more books. Maybe I can buy a book that will uh, t teach me courage. <laughs> uh, what will I buy? Finish reading to be able to read two chapters a day. That will be pr practically useless later on. Uh, finish reading to boost the effects of eating Chinese food more. Catch more bugs. Reading it may raise your courage. The Amazing Khan Saga. Sure. Wait, what? <laughs> Amazing Khan Saga. Farewell to man. Man God. <laughs> That's silly. Where's my understanding? Understanding, courage. So I already have men of history. Okay. Alright, so now I can go back home. And I can try and increase my courage just a teensy bit. I I mean like it's completely pointless. There's no point to me doing this. <laughs> After December 3rd, I cannot hang out with Naoto. <laughs> can't start a social link. Can't advance the social link. There's nothing I can do. Uh, so, this read. Man God. Ooh, only two chapters, though. Every chapter begins. All oh, men have the great spirit of masculinity within themselves. The Amazing Khan spends 500 days in the mountains seeking to prove a rumor about the true masters of manliness. You feel more like a real man even than before. My courage has greatly increased. Wow. Just for the first chapter? Neat. Early morning after school. Uh, 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 wrong buttons. Okay. Alright, I guess I'm going straight home. This is how this is gonna go. <laughs> I see your game, I see what you're doing. <laughs> There's legitimately nothing to do now. <laughs> Do, 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 do. Uh, man god. Finish reading. <gasps> My courage increased. <laughs> I heard it. <laughs> I heard the sound. <laughs> uh, 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 the button. Status. My statis. Uh, switch info. I'm daring. I need max. I need max courage, though. <laughs> so, uh, maybe you could go. So, if I read at home, could I continue reading after the day? I'm going to try. Oh man, have the great spirit. Okay. Amazing Khan attempts to retreat from the world of masculinity. But his powerful call torments him. Yay. <laughs> cool. Daytime, evening? And now, the weather. The week ended on a wet note as rain clouds moved into the area. As a result... A thick fog is expected to form in the Inaba region later tonight. 
It seems the fog will set in tonight. It means I have to watch the midnight channel. <laughs> It's midnight. The fog has set in. Does that mean that my time limit to save Nanako was a little bit sooner than I thought? No one is appearing on the midnight channel. Nanako has been rescued, and you were you were able to thwart or to arrest the culprit. There's probably no need to watch the Midnight Channel anymore. Can I read a book? <laughs> Damn it. Fog is covering the town. Yep, it advanced time. Cool. Damn, that's a lot of fog. The fog from yesterday is still, he uh, still there this morning. Take a look at this. Namatame's in today's paper. The front page's headline article says that Namatame has regained consciousness. The day before dawn, the suspect, Taro Namatame, who had been confined in a local hospital, regained consciousness. In response to police questioning, he testified that he is sorry for what he has done and was scared. From here on, the police are hoping to solve the entire case based on the suspect's dep uh, deposition. So it's finally over. Yeah, seriously. I wish we could have done it sooner. Isn't the fog kind of thick this morning? And it's so chilly. <sighs> it rarely gets this cold in November. Oh, it's you guys. Perfect timing. I just got a call from the hospital. They said that starting today, it's okay to visit Nanako-chan. So she's getting a little better. Thank goodness! Oh, is that today's paper? So you already know about him. Uh... How's Nanako-chan doing? He's regained consciousness, but it's hard to say. He's still mentally unstable, but we're slowly piecing together a story. This is still a secret, but I guess it's okay to tell you guys. You know that diary we found? There were entries about Miss Yamano and Miss Konishi in it. Looks like Namatame had been making advances on Miss Konishi. That son of a bitch! Yeah, well, I'm gonna head to the hospital now. Dojima-san's recovering too, so I need to go over a few things about this case with him. Yosuke. Sorry. I'm alright. Namatame's been caught. He can't hurt anyone now. But forget him. Let's all go visit Nanako-chan after school. Of course! Let's tell the others once we get to school. Friendship powers activate. <laughs> no! What? <laughs> Just a reminder, the finals are next week. How's your studying going? Cool. <laughs> Still have to do schoolwork. Damn it. <laughs> Nanako, everyone's here to see you. <laughs> Big bro. Talking st uh, still seems painful for her. Nevertheless, Nanako looks happy. Dojima san! Ugh. How many times does this make it today? I understand that you're worried about your daughter, but you still need your rest, too. <clears throat> Sorry. Um, are your injuries that bad? Hmm. Well, my wounds have just closed up, and it seems I have a couple of fractures as well. I'm sorry. I'll wheel him back to his room immediately. What are you apologizing for? It's almost time for your checkup, so make sure you're back in your room before then. Big bro. Uh. 
uh, I'm here. Yeah, I'm so glad. <sighs> Naruko closed her eyes with a relieved expression. She seems to have fallen asleep. You received an explanation concerning Nanako's condition from the doctor. Her condition is stable for now, but uh, I never thought I'd say this as a doctor, but we still can't figure out the cause of Nanako-chan's symptoms. That's why we can only administer temporary treatments to alleviate her current pains. But she's not in danger anymore, is she? She's regained consciousness, but we can't let our guard down yet. All we can do for now is to monitor her condition closely. <sighs> Adachi, how's it going with Namatame? Well, he's awake now, but he's in no condition to tell us anything useful. We only get a little time each day to interrogate him, so we're stuck until his strength recovers. I see. I should get back to work as soon as possible. Hopefully by then, Nanako will be out of the hospital. Um... I think Nanako-chan can get more peace and quiet if she stays here. It's so foggy out, and there's been some weird rumors going around. Seems like no one knows why there's so much fog in town. It's true. The number of patients complaining about fog-related health problems has increased, which is quite unusual. Is... Isn't that just a rumor? I can't say for sure that it has no effect on the human body. It certainly could be a psychological effect. People's anxiety over the fog could cause problems. You know, considering that three of the town's murders seem to uh, be discovered during foggy uh, days. <laughs> that could be it. But as far as the fog's chemical makeup, well, that's not my field, so I can only speculate. What concerns me is that transportation of our medical supplies has been delayed due to the fog. Fog-related health problems. Oh, that's just ridiculous. Anyone who says that is just blowing smoke. Nanako has somehow regained consciousness, but it seems that it will take more time until she fully recovers. Namatame's... Bleh. Namatame's interrogation that has finally begun. The fog that won't lift and people's mysterious health problems. For now, it seems that you can only watch and wait to see how things will turn out. Isn't this weather strange? How could it be lasting so long? I've never seen anything like it. Also, it's like pea yellow. <laughs> I wonder what's causing it. It's so creepy. I heard that a friend of mine's son got sick from the fog and collapsed. You know how sensitive children are to that sort of thing. I heard something too. They say an old man was driving through the fog and got into an accident. What? Did he lose control? Well, he'd never been in an accident or even gotten a ticket before. So something seems off. Isn't that scary? I've even heard there are experts saying it's poisonous. I wonder if that's true. Do you think it's, you know, because of that global warming thing? This town's changed a lot over the years. I wish the government would step in and do something about this. Oh, I agree completely. If we're going to pay taxes, I expect the authorities to do their jobs. This fog is poison! It's a gas filled with viruses! Don't inhale the fog or you'll die! He's not the first one like that I've seen lately. Poisonous gas, though? Oh, I'm sure it's not true. Oh. Hmm. Is something wrong? Oh my. I... I think I'm coming down with something. You... you can't be serious. <laughs> oh, that's right. I needed to do some grocery shopping. Well then. 
Wow, she got out of there quick. Business has been so slow lately. After school, the evening. Uh, now I'm home. Time to read. It means very little, but I'm gonna do it anyways. <laughs> Yay. I finished the book. It's now Tuesday. Whoa, that fog. You over here soon is talking. The weather's really been weird lately. What's up with all this fog? This fog looks like it's going to stay here forever. But I heard it's nothing to worry about. That's what some great guy on TV said. Oh. I also heard that it's poisonous. Very toxic. And nobody even knows why it's toxic. Man. Just thinking about how toxic it is makes me feel ill. I should probably stay at home for a while. <laughs> You're just too lazy to take the finals beginning next week, aren't you? Early morning, afternoon. There it is. Do you know what an atlas is? A book of maps. Yeah, it's a book of maps. I'm gonna be sure, though. Yeah, it's a book of maps. Click. Yay, my knowledge is increased. M smirt. F school. Wow. Everything's all spooky. Oh, cool. So spent with Chie, Son on Nicole. So I could still spend time with my social links. It's just all creepy. Interesting. So I could, uh, yeah, I could still do some social link stuff. Uh. Uh. <sighs> it was. I can't remember when the tofu is available. The babu tofu that makes me all. That gives me the goods. <laughs> that gives me the <laughs> courage. Today's special is the Mabo Tofu. Hell yeah! Let's go! Courage has greased. After school, the evening. Yay. Can I go out? Oh, I can. This fog, though. Shopping district. I'm gonna do some exploration. Let's fucking go. Nobody's out. Except for this guy. This guy. This guy. I asked my boss to come drinking, but he said he was too busy. What the hell? I went out of my way to invite him along. I thought about asking someone else, but I've never been drinking with anyone else. Okay. Wow, practically no one is out. It's super creepy. Alright, I guess I'm going back home then. Do, 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 do. Hey, it's me, Yosuke. You want to hang out tomorrow? 
Okay. Awesome. Let me ask Daisuke, too. I don't want people to think we're dating or anything. See you tomorrow. Why would people think we're dating? We just want to hang out. Uh, office work manual. Knowledge intelligence. <laughs> I'm gonna work. <laughs> uh, you encounter a joke that you don't understand. Go for a literal translation. Though you were unable to translate the joke, you achieved your goal. Alright, well. <laughs> Okina Station. What kept you? I already told Daisuke about this, but do you want to catch a movie? I saw something about a movie that looked good. It was called Blood, Sweat, Tears, and Baseball. <laughs> what else is blank? <laughs> Sounds good. All right. I knew you would like it. <sighs> I know. I told you already. I don't want to see that one. Let's watch it! It promises this to be an entertaining day. You feel your relationship with y Daisuke and Ko is going to come closer soon. You spend time with Yosuke and Daisuke. Yay. Red right at home, gender job, gender job, gosh shrine fortune. Spent with Naoto. She's not out. Well, she would be. <laughs> she would be if I had our social link. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to call it a day, though. Thanks for watching. Sincerely hope that you enjoyed the video. You're going to be a great day. Stay safe and wearing a mask wherever possible. Next time, more of this. More of scary fog time. More of me being concerned about stuff and things. Alright, let's go. Good night. Wait, no, not good night. Oh, bye.